We're told this all may have started over a simple misunderstanding, but according to the victim and witnesses, it escalated quickly. It all started when a woman who does not want to be identified says she agreed to let her acquaintance, Ebony Dixon, stay at her house on Detroit's east side for a month. She got put out of her home not far from here, and she asked me if she could stay. So I talked to my landlord about it. She, they said she was fine to stay. But then this victim says Dixon, a Highland Park Reserve officer, started trash talking her on social media because Dixon allegedly could not get into the victim's home one day because Dixon did not have a key. So that's when Dixon decided to move out last week. She came to get her stuff. She had her brother waiting. Um, her brother called his friend, so they're all getting her stuff. She got her stuff peacefully. But then the victim and her friend, who does not want his name used, says things turned dangerous. When she came out, I said, okay, are you finished? Because she closed the door. She stood on the porch and said, this B has the audacity to ask me if I'm finished. Pulled a gun out, pointed at both of us, and then she shot it in the air. She pointed the gun at you? Yes, by both of us. Witnesses say there were children outside at the time. No one was injured and the victims say Dixon drove off. According to the victims, Dixon, who also works as a security guard, was wearing her uniform for that job. We spoke by phone to the chief of the Highland Park Police Department, who says the gun allegedly used was not believed to be issued by the department. And we want to point out, as a police reservist, Dixon is in a volunteer position. Detroit police are investigating, and sources say Dixon will be facing charges, including aggravated felonious assault. It's just abuse of power. Like, you're supposed to protect our city, and that's not what you're doing. You're causing harm and mayhem, just like the people walking down the street being crazy. Anything else could have really, really more likely happened, but I'm glad, I'm glad that she did leave. And while Detroit police investigate, the chief of police here in Highland Park says her status as a police reservist here is under administrative review. At the Highland Park Police Department, Tara Edwards, 7 Action News.